M10 Business is very excited about today's experiment. We're using 5G. What we would like to demonstrate here is our Ford leadership, both from an IT perspective as well as from a network perspective. And today we're actually showcasing how we can use this in the automotive industry. This is the first time we demonstrate 5G immobility in the continent, not just in South Africa. So clearly I'm a little bit tense, but at the same time very, very excited. Ericsson has partnered with MTN on the road to 5G as MTN is the leading operator in Africa. Ericsson has the leading technology firm that makes complete sense. Seeing the first application of 5G is in the safety features of the car so that it's able to recognize what's around it and can help you take preventative measures to ensure your safety. It is critical that you actually have got very limited latency and you can send accurate information across the network. The driver will actually be using virtual reality and dependent on the network to drive the car. That is going to be a real test of both the network and IoT and I wish the driver best of luck. <laughs> My professional driving career started about 15 years ago when I started as an instructor at Gerotech. Basically training, advanced trading, high performance. I feel very excited to drive the blacked out car. We'll probably do around 40 or 50 kilometers an hour on the track. Being a passenger in a car that's completely blacked out or being a passenger with another driver is always a little bit scary. But I have full confidence in this 5G technology that the driver will be able to steer and go around the cones exactly as he would have done had he had full vision. It is definitely a dangerous endeavor. I'm putting my life in the hands of technology, but I'm trusting the guys. I believe that everything will work out 100%. Today is really a milestone for us as MTN. Our promise to our customers is always to make sure that we bring, you know, cutting edge technology. And today is evident to that. We're the first mobile company to be launching, testing 5G in this establishment. It's all about speeds, eh? making sure that we bring internet to our customers at very high speeds. What IoT means for Africa is that it's going to give visibility to remote assets that are out in the field. Uh, they could be very far away. You could be monitoring pipelines. It can help with safety features. There are tons and myriads of other things you can do with 5G. I see tremendous potential in Africa. This is where the world is heading. This is the future.